Grace and Trip first started dating, I was so protective of her. I would used to go behind the couch and sit for hours until something would happen. <laughs> Sounds like a perfectly harmonious rhythm. Grayson and Tripp had a nine-year anniversary. For those of you that don't know, their nine-year anniversary is today. Like I was 13 years old when we first got together. <laughs> <laughs> Just like fine wine, they age to perfection here. <laughs> Think <laughs> so pretty. Trip and Rachel, you guys are surrounded by the people who love you most. They care about you. They've walked with you. And as you begin this life together, you need to remember that you're not alone. That these people out here and others will be with you on your journey as long as God allows them to be to encourage you, to support you and remind you of these sacred vows you're here to take today. We are here today to celebrate the love which Tripp and Rachel have for each other and to give recognition to their decision to commit their lives to each other totally and permanently as God intended. You look so good. Thank you. How does that look? to be permanent. It's a unique, truly unique and beautiful relationship. It's founded on trust. It's founded on responsibility and the fulfillment of God's purpose. And you consider that no one else will ever make quite this commitment to you in this life. It's truly special. You've chosen to bind your lives together before God. It's a sacred moment. So Tripp, I ask, do you intend today to take Rachel to be your wife, to have and to hold? to love and to cherish for as long as you both shall live? I do. And Rachel, do you intend today to take Trip to be your husband, to have and to hold, to love and to cherish as long as you both shall live? I do. Now, God has shown us the key to a godly marriage through Jesus. Trip, you'll, you'll lead the way, as always. <laughs> I, Trip, take you, Rachel. I, Trip, take you, Rachel. As a gift from the hand of God. As a gift from the hand of God. I promise to love you. I promise to love you. To hold you. To hold you. To be faithful to you. To be faithful to you. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. And now Rachel. I, Rachel, take you, Trip. I, Rachel, take you, Trip. As a gift from the hand of God. As a gift from the hand of God. I promise to love you. I promise to love you. To hold you. To hold you. To be faithful to you. To be faithful to you. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poor. For richer or for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Oh, I thought I could do that. <laughs> <laughs> you did. How beautiful. It's a testimony to the, the love that you have for one another and also the, the, <laughs> the, the way that you understand, uh, the gift that you can give. Tripp and Rachel will serve one another communion as a couple for the first time to honor Jesus, who's the foundation of a godly marriage in their lives. It's been their desire that this ceremony point, points us all to Jesus, who demonstrated his love for us and gave himself freely, shedding his own blood on the cross for our sins. Through Jesus' sacrifice and resurrection, we all can have forgiveness 
and eternal so life in Jesus. This cup, as you take it, represents Christ's blood spilled for you. And this bread represents Jesus' Maybe body broken for you on your behalf. As you take it, do this in remembrance of Jesus as your first action. Yeah. Because Tripp and Rachel have desired each other in marriage, and we have witnessed this before God in our gathering, affirming the acceptance and responsibility of such a union, and have pledged their love and faith to each other, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Those who God has joined together, let no man separate. Tripp, you may kiss your breath. <laughs> Cool.